In this video, I'm going to play golf with a full set of the new tailor-made stealth golf clubs and prove it's not just about a driver with a red face. And I'm gonna do it now. Hi everyone, my name is James Robinson and welcome to this YouTube channel. Guys, yes, today I'm playing golf with a full set of tailor-made stealth golf clubs. We have the tailor-made stealth plus driver, tailor-made stealth plus three wood, tailor-made stealth hybrid and the tailor-made stealth irons which i think are going to go under the radar in 2022 so here's how this is going to go we're going to play a handful of holes here at woolly park golf club and see what we can score using only the tailor-made stealth golf clubs for 2022 guys if you are interested in any of the reviews regarding the tailor-made stealth golf club be it the irons be it the driver be it the three wood be it the hybrid the hybrid by the way wow then they're on the channel already so hit that subscribe button and i'll link those in the description below but for now what can we score we're going to tee off with a long iron on this first hole i'm going to play a bit of a mishmash of holes as well to make sure we get all these golf clubs in there guys what are we going to shoot these irons are so forgiving oh look at that it's a tiny bit left but we're taking it all day yes please and you see, the big reason for this video is that it's been a long time since I've seen a full set of golf clubs that offer so much, that seem so well-rounded, that seem, I'm just going to come out and say it, almost perfect. Okay, fair to say we have around 150 yards in to this first green. And that is on the fairway, so I'm going to clean and place it. I'm going to hit, I could probably hit pitching wedge here, I'm going to hit a nine iron and try and control it. That's the one thing which one thing which when i did test these stealth irons i was quite impressed with the ability to knock them down even though the jam pack full of technology and fairly strong lofted middle of the green give yourself a chance or draw it onto the pin nicely come on be good oh that's delightful that is so good I'm even cleaning them. You see whoever was in charge of this echo dampening system in these new stealth irons in my opinion He's a genius. A very, very clever man. Well, what's commonly known as a genius. And to have them perform like that, um, I mean, we'll take it all day, won't we? For a set of irons, which will probably be dubbed as high handicap irons or mid handicap irons, maybe. I could gain them. I mean, I'm not sure if I want to, but when you come out today and you see how easy it is to kind of play with these, why wouldn't you? You get the ascent angle, you get the stoppage, you get the distance and you get that feel. You almost get everything. Right, and to keep things tailor-made, I have put the old spider back in the bag, so let's see if we can cause some damage with this. Bit of stoppage, yes please. Okay, for birdie on the first, and when I did my iron review, guys, I played this hole as well, and I actually had a similar putt. If you put me here in every round in the summer for two, I'm taking that all day long. Can we make it this time? No, never moved. But that's a solid par on the opening hole with the tailor-made stealth golf clubs. And you see, the reason why this is such a big deal for me is that in the past, I've kind of openly spoken out about full sets, about family sets, about sets which really would just go on to be rental sets, like the M4 and the M6 and the Sim. I don't think this is that. I think these are different and I'm going to stop talking so much in a minute and just get on with playing golf if I can find my glove but for me the biggest problem for the tailor-made stealth irons is the tailor-made p790 irons because although these are dramatically better looking than previous iron sets within the family they're still not p790s are they so will people try them I'm not so sure let's go stealth plus three wood massive fan of this the head cover's still really tight let's take that corner on a little bit and hopefully set up another birdie putt this looks so good down at the ball by the way wind strong off left so let's see if we can battle that a little bit oh look at that that's such a good ball flight I think that's massive as well, you know, that was out of the screws. Now, for people who are new to this channel, that down this second hole is absolutely absurd. 
like crazy. The Stealth Plus 3 wood is definitely making a little bit of a run to try and get into my bag for this year. I'm so excited to test so many golf clubs and have a bit of a change around in the bag this year. The Magpie's sort of clawing at the cage. I don't know if you keep a Magpie in a cage. If you do, they've got RSPCA probably on with you, but anyway. Come right. Oh, come down then. You stayed there. Nightmare. Right, this isn't what you want for birdie. Anything within probably 10 feet is a good effort here. Go on. Yeah. Excellent distance. Right, six foot for par. We'll take it. You see, I know you've all been waiting to see the driver. Drive ball par four coming up. Right, so to take advantage of this hole, we have to go over these trees with the tailor-made Stealth Plus driver. Now, if you've not seen the review on the channel already of this and its red face, then make sure you check that out. I'm sure you know what it is by now, but if you don't, get to know. The, the video's there, right, come on. Oh, that is so good. That is so good. That was down into the wind. Wonderful. I think that's what you call a uh, centered strike. So the only club we have left to hit is the Stealth Hybrid. I'm going to hit that off the next tee off the par four and check how versatile it is. Can we play it down a little bit, even with all the technology that's designed to help you get the ball up in the air? From the testing I've already done, I think we should be able to. I can see a ball through those trees. It's not on the green, but um, it's safe. That wind must be stronger than we thought. I mean, that literally needed like an extra two yards and we're talking it lands on the green and probably runs up to the flag. That's quite annoying. It's also a winter golf here in the UK, so we'll take it. Not much run. Ah, well, let's play a chip and let's see if we can maybe secure that eagle. I'm going to use the pitching wedge from the set here because I think that's what Chris would want me to do. Oh, that goes left more than I thought. That left foot. I mean, it felt fine. Not sure about the result. Not move. That's exactly where I wanted it. That's another par. That feels like a bogey as well after that drive. Disappointing. Very disappointing. So we're going to do something a little bit different on this hole. We're going to tee off from the rough because I want to see just how versatile, especially from that lie, this hybrid is. Guys, if you want to see the review of this hybrid, then make sure you do go and check it out. Can we play a little kind of low cut down this par four out of this quite horrible lie? Oh, that is remarkable. And that felt and sounded gorgeous. Oh, yes, please. Honestly, I think this is the best club of the lot, and I think the lot is uh, pretty good itself as well. So guys, if you're still here, get in the comments below and give me some support. Can we birdie this final hole and get under par? I feel like we deserve to be, I feel like probably deserve to be where we are around level par. Let's see if we can play a good one in here and shoot under par with only the tailor-made stealth golf clubs right we couldn't have really hit a better shot there if we tried again i'm going to send in the little pitching wedge and just see how versatile it is into this short approach around the fairway so i'm going to clean and place that another kind of 70 yarder come back oh it's long it's long. That's what it does kind of worry me a little bit with just having this set. This is why for me you do need a specialist wedge because that's come out so hot and fiery. Sometimes you can get a little bit caught out. That's a missed green, James. We'll take it. We'll take it and we will run. That is a quite I'm going to say disappointing. It's not really disappointing, but it's level par with the tailor-made stealth 
golf clubs those guys thank you so much for watching i really hope you have enjoyed that if you have smash that subscribe button below and leave us a like we are well on the way to 200,000 subscribers and i would love you to be a part of it guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you at the same time tomorrow bye